2017 Chevrolet Equinox Redline Edition. Chevrolet first introduced the midsize Equinox crossover in 2004. Rolling out a variety of additional trim levels and even a special Winter Olympic Games themed model throughout the course of the first generation's life cycle. In 2009 the second generation Equinox debuted at the North American International Auto Show in Detroit. With a 2.4-LITER inline four-cylinder engine as standard and an available 3.0-liter V6. Finally, the latest third generation was introduced on September 22nd of last year with three engine choices. Forward collision warning and support for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto for the infotainment system. At the moment the Equinox is Chevy's second best-selling model which means it was shown for the recent rash of Redline special editions introduced at this year's Chicago Auto Show. Upgrades include just a few tweaks here and there for the styling while the rest of the car's mechanicals and interior remain unaltered. The 2018 Equinox Redline Edition takes inspiration from the Redline product preview first shown in Las Vegas from the 2015 Summer Show. All the upgrades can be found on the exterior including in the nose where a new grille with a diamond pattern insert and black finish sits front and center. Moving to the sides you'll also find the blackout treatment added to the side view mirror covers while in the corners sit large 19 inch wheels also with a black finish. The rear windows continue the theme with an inky black tint while the various Chevy bowtie badges are also blacked out. The Equinox Redline package is offered with the mid-grade LT trim level. Joining the model in Chicago are equal treatments for the Crows, Malibu, Camaro, Trax, Traverse, Colorado and Silverado. Each of the new Redline models will be available by the end of the year with the Equinox Redline edition slated to hit dealerships by October. What makes the Chevrolet Equinox Redline edition special? While a redline addition for the Camaro seems about right it's a little questionable for a model like the Equinox. Sure, the upgrades don't look bad per se but they don't really look spectacular either. In fact if I'm being honest it's all rather too mild for my taste. With a name like redline you'd expect something big and bold something that screams maximum RPM s and ultimate speed. Instead, this is pretty much more of the same. We've seen the blacked out exterior components approach used for previous special editions and this one in particular fails to impress. It seems like Chevy is just spraying black paint here and there to see if they can get customers to drop a little extra cash in the hopes they'll stand out from the crowd. And given the success rates of these sorts of special edition models, I wouldn't be surprised if it sells. As a reminder, the Equinox LT comes standard with a 7.0-INCH touchscreen, Sirius XM radio, hid headlights, heated side view mirrors, 17-inch aluminum wheels and an 8-way power adjusting driver's seat. A seat heating function, dual zone climate control and panoramic sunroof are optional. Under the hood is a turbocharged 1.5-LITER 4-cylinder engine producing 170 horsepower and 203 pound-feet of torque. All of which is routed to the front axle through a 6-speed automatic transmission. An AWD drivetrain is offered as an available option. Today, Chevrolet announced the introduction of the Redline Special Edition Series at the Chicago Auto Show. Available on nine Chevrolet cars, trucks and crossovers, Redline is the broadest cross-portfolio special edition ever offered by the brand. Redline made its debut in concept form at the 2015 Summer Show in Las Vegas. Inspired by a strong positive reception from customers and the success of special editions across the portfolio, Chevrolet expanded Redline across nine vehicles in the car, truck and crossover segments. Cruz LT, Sedan and Hatchback, Malibu LT, Camaro LT, SS Coupe and Convertible, Trax LT, Equinox LT, Traverse Premier, Colorado LT, Silverado Double Cab LT Z71, Crew Cab LT Z71. 
Redline is another example of Chevrolet bringing SEMA concepts to showrooms, said Brian Sweeney, U.S. Vice President of Chevrolet. The SEMA show has proven to be a great way to identify customization trends in the industry and quickly apply those trends to our most popular Chevrolet models. Based on the strong interest Redline attracted at the show, we believe they will be very popular with customers looking for standard cars, trucks and crossovers. All Redline vehicles are equipped with black wheels featuring distinct red hash marks, black nameplates with a red outline, black tower grills and black Chevrolet bow tie logos. For that vehicles feature design elements tailored to the preferences of those specific customers. For example, the Silverado and Colorado Redlines feature red tow hooks, while Camaro Redline features unique black hash marks above the wheels, a design cue taken from Chevy's long heritage in motorsports. Our special edition lineup has been popular with customers and dealers alike, said Sweeney. Since the introduction of special editions on vehicles the like Silverado and Camaro, vehicle average transaction prices have increased. Time to turn has decreased and conquest rates have risen which has contributed to making Chevrolet the fastest growing brand in the industry two years in a row. Silverado red lines are the first available for purchase orders can be placed at Chevrolet dealerships now. Availability will be cadenced. And all red line vehicles will be available for purchase by the end of 2017 calendar year.